Hey there guys, uh, today I'm going to be reviewing the knock-on, knock-to-it uh, thumb release from John Dudley. Uh, it's a Carter made. I believe John Dudley has worked together with them to come out with this one. Uh, he sells it on his site. I believe that's the only place actually you can get it actually. That's on knockonarchery.com. Uh, it's a two... Two uh, two finger release. It's very customizable. You can customize the thumb grip to have it further out and thumb deeper in the pocket. I like it about right there. Uh, so I had it about for about three weeks, and the more I shoot it, the more I like it. Uh, I've been very consistent on it. I've getting better. I've been getting better, obviously. Uh, but I just started getting into uh, archery this year um, I did maybe six years ago I went hunting once or twice with longbow <laughs> uh, that didn't go too well and I hung up uh, hunting completely for about three years uh, I played softball a lot and that's all I did I put my life or I mean my focus more on on uh, sports and softball on the softball side then archery archie didn't uh didn't really attract me at the time for for anything that i wanted to do but i ended up tearing my acl here in august and well i guess i have to have surgery for that but um so i started shooting uh bows since i really can't play too many sports right now uh i bought my first bow off my brother here uh, it's an elite ritual. It's a 33, I believe it's a 33 axle to axle. Uh, but yeah, uh, I really like the the knock on. I don't, I didn't see too many reviews on it on YouTube here, so I was hoping to get at least something out there. Uh, it's very customizable. You got a Allen wrench right there, one right there, small one right there at the at the finger there. And one in the back for your travel and sensitivity and all that. Um, if you're looking to get into it, I would def definitely recommend you to. Um, I would buy another one for myself uh, if I if anything would happen or whatever. I mean, I just got it, so I mean, it lasts me for years, hopefully. Um, so yeah, here it goes once. Um, I like it <clears throat> so far, but, uh, I've been also shooting the back tension on this one. It's, uh, the thumb release that I've used. I use my brother's, the, I believe it's the true ball blade. Uh, for me personally, it was set a little too hot or so it seemed anyways, barely put any pressure on the, the thumb really on the release there and then i just shoot, it would shoot here uh on this one i have to i shoot the back tension just to get the motion of just bringing back the uh the motion of it i guess just bringing it back to make it fire i like a 
back tension. Um, I believe actually my accuracy is way better if I focus on it, on bringing my hand back to release it rather than I catch myself sometimes even punching it, punching the trigger sometimes like, like that. That's when I sometimes switch over to the back tension just to get that rhythm again. And then my accuracy is definitely better. Uh, if I do that, if I just bring it, if I do bring it back to, to release the trigger there. Um, but yeah, so far uh, I liked it. Um, so like and subscribe. Hopefully I can bring more videos like this or at least hunting videos. Um, I'm wanting to uh, video a couple hunts here and hopefully upload them. Uh, uh, upload a couple videos, maybe just shooting. Uh, I'll do hunting. Maybe I'll do a gear. If you guys want to, I'll do a gear. Um, a gear review or what I have this year for hunting uh, or just a bow. Uh, I just got a new uh, string to put on it. The serving was starting to come off, so I put on a new string. That's why they're not matching. I didn't change the cables on it. The cables weren't actually too long, changed too long by my brother. But, uh, but yeah, I just put a string on it for right now. So maybe next year or whatever, I'll put uh, cables on and everything else. So, yeah, like and subscribe, uh, comment down below, I'll try to respond, uh, so yeah.